Hey guys, welcome back. I don't know if you just saw my recent video where I'm wearing the same thing, and that's because I just filmed it, and that was my entire Hermes handbag collection. And in that video, I promised you guys that I would do a follow-up what's in my bag for this beautiful 35 centimeter Tosca colored Togo leather gold hardware frickin'. You guys, this is heavy, so heavy, which is why um, I told you guys I love a 35 centimeter because I truly need a carry-all. I love a big bag. I love the way it looks and I also need it for functional reasons. I put a lot of things in my bag. Today's a little bit of an exception. I think I have more than usual in here, but generally those little tiny micro bags are just absolutely not going to cut it for me for you know day-to-day -day wear. I need a functional big bag. I do like a little bag for evening, for nighttime, fun nights out, stuff like that, but not for day-to-day. -day. So let's get into what's in my bag. And I'm, you know, when I do these videos, I'm, I, I really show you what's in my bag and some of it is weird. It just is. And you might just be like, wow, why? But I keep it real with you. I don't organize my bags. I don't put things in my bags. This is what's in my bag. Yeah, let's get started. Woo. Before I start pulling stuff out of here, I just want to tell you, I love this bag so much. I recently bought it. I made a video about it. I got it from this amazing store called Hope Classics in Toronto. It's such a good price. And I don't know, for you guys out there in the US or in Europe or across the world in Australia, and beyond. Hope Classics is so great because it's in Canadian dollars, which is like so much cheaper than what you'd find at the same dollar for dollar, but higher currency price point. A lot of Hermes bags, especially in these special colors, are so expensive on the resale market and they're in US dollars. This was kind of like a lower price and in Canadian dollars, so it's just like a win-win. I just want to tell you, not sponsored at all, I just really want to share the love. So. I love that. I love everything about it. I love the grain of leather. It's like a bigger grain of Togo. You know, Togo has so many different grains within the Togo leather family. And I just love that this happens to be a bigger grain and veinier leather. I just got so lucky on this bag. Um, so I'll just start with the first thing, which is my wallet, my Prada wallet. This is just like such a great functional classic wallet. It's in that, um, what do you call it? Hermes calls this kind of leather um, Epsom. What does Prada call it? Guys, help me out. Write in the comments below what Prada calls this like stiff leather. What's it called? What is it called? Safiano? Is that it? Will you let me know if it's Safiano? I think it's Safiano. So, you know, nothing really to show you in here, just my credit cards and really, I don't think I have any money. <laughs> I have a five, a Canadian five. You guys call this Monopoly money and you're not that wrong. <laughs> really nothing, nothing special in here, but I do love this wallet. It holds a lot. It's compact, but you know, you could really fit a lot in here. So this is like a very good wallet. I've been using it for years. It's just so durable and really great quality. Very impressed with this Prada wallet. Next is uh, kind of strange, but I keep my workout gloves in my purse because I don't know what happened to me recently, but I've kind of become a workout girl. I never thought this would happen to me, and I am actually very, very proud of myself that I got here. It took me like two years to get here. Two years of like off and on going to the gym, like I never liked going, but I would just go. And then sometimes I'd just bail last minute. Like, no, I do not want to go. But I don't know what happened to me. Over the spring and summer, I just kind of got in a flow and a zone and I have not stopped. So I'm very, very proud of myself. These are my gloves for when I do circuit training because I don't like to get calluses on my hand. It hurts my hands when I'm lifting weights with like, um, you know, hard metal. So I use gloves and these are pretty much always in my purse. I transfer them from purse to purse and it's really great for working out. My iPhone X, it's my husband, it's my screensaver. 
Um, and the Lumi case, which is really great. It lights up, so it's really actually great for when I do videos at night, Insta stories, stuff like that, like Instagram, kind of like a fun day-to-day -day fashion diary kind of place to be. Just... Next is my stay little travel makeup case which you've seen in pretty much all of my what's in my bags this must have been like 9.99 or something from the drugstore and like the aisle of travel stuff and i always wanted a little makeup case this size because it's perfect for everything that i need um this is just i'm not going to go through everything it's a bunch of little lip glosses estee lauder charlotte tilbury Essence, which is a really cheap brand. I just want to show you this was $3.99 from the drugstore really good But this is the most noteworthy thing in here So I will tell you about it and I have told you about it before it's color science and it's a mineral sunscreen So it's a powder and you just put it on So, you know, I apply cream sunscreen every day SPF like 30 or something, but it definitely doesn't last the whole day. So, you know, after a few hours when I'm out and about, I will apply this powder all over my face and it's a mineral sunscreen, which means it instantly reflects the sun from your skin. So it's not a sunscreen cream that has to absorb into your skin 15 minutes before it starts working. So that's just like kind of works right away. And I really like it for when I'm on the go for just added sun protection. So it's my little makeup case. Pure gum, which is aspartame free, um, chocolate mint, just a really delicious flavor. And I love that it's aspartame free. Hand cream, Loxy 10. This is like a floral hand cream. I should probably use some because my hands are. Oh my gosh. <laughs> really? When you live in a cold climate, right now it's not cold, it's still, you know, warm outside, but like it does get very cold here in Toronto and I always need hand cream in my purse during like the winter months because my skin gets so dry, especially my hands because I always wash my hands. You've got to also wash your hands more in the winter. I don't know about this smell though, very floral, but it is good and moisturizing. So yeah, my Luxie 10 hand moisturizer, um, very good for cold climates. And I also took out at the same time my Celine sunglasses. These are so gorgeous. These are just aviators and they're very, very cute. They have like rose gold lenses that are just really, really cool. Out of all my sunglasses, I get complimented the most on these, which is surprising because they're just aviators, but I guess they're really special because of the mirror rose gold uh, lens. So um, I truly love these because they're just, they're easy to wear. They're not too funky, um, but they still do have like kind of a special look for just a classic aviator style. And they don't take up too much room in my bag, which wouldn't matter anyways. But I do have another pair of sunglasses in here because I'm crazy. I didn't mean to. I, I actually had these in another purse and I didn't know I had the other pair of sunglasses in here so I threw them in. These are in an, a super old school Dior case because I lost the case for these um, Ray-Ban aviators. This, these, this Dior case, I had like a pair of sunglasses. I don't even know what happened to them but this is an old Dior case I keep for these. Ray-Ban aviators, these are just a good classic. These are really good for every day. Can't go wrong with a Ray-Ban aviator. Um, but I'm not going to put them back in my purse because I don't need two pairs of sunnies in there. Oh my God, I'm such a freak. I just, I have another hand cream, another L'Occitane hand cream. Sometimes I have like, two or three purses going at the same time because I don't always want to take a Birkin with me everywhere I go. Sometimes it's a statement I just don't want to make and I like to have just a more chill 
bag close by if I'm running out, so I'll throw some of my things in my other bag. Um, and when I do that, sometimes I end up with like two of the same things in my bags because I forget what's in what. Um, but this is another Loxy 10 hand cream and it smells a lot better. I wish I used that instead of the floral. Um, Oh, my Ebates check, actually Rakuten, they changed the name to Rakuten, it's weird, I don't know, but um, it's for $8.42, but actually right now, my Rakuten balance is really nice because I've kind of bought a few things, um, but they sent me a check for $8.42, and I don't know if you know what Rakuten is, but it's an amazing incentive to buy things that you're gonna buy but online instead where you get cash backs I always let you guys know on Instagram when there's like high cash back because you know sometimes shop up has double the cash back and I let you guys know um, and then there's just some stores that I shop at that have like really good cash back sometimes intermix has like 10% cash back that's like a very good chunk of money if you're buying a couple of things or a high ticket item that's a good percent of money to get back so there's my check for that <laughs> almonds because when I'm on the go sometimes I'm out all day and I do not have time I don't have time to stop and get something to eat I don't have time to go sit down and eat I don't even have time to go run in somewhere and get something quick I need to have a snack on the go when I'm starving sometimes I'll take a protein bar but sometimes I just eat almonds, I stuff my face with them. This was like full a week ago, but if I'm hungry and I'm in my car driving and I have nowhere to go, I'll just stuff my face with these almonds. So they're just really good to have. And actually, I highly recommend you take some nuts with you in your purse. I mean, hopefully you're not allergic. It's just, it's such a good healthy snack with fiber and protein. It just kind of holds you over until you can get some real food. So almonds. I want to take a bunch of things out at once because it's just getting down to the wire you know what I mean <laughs> my son's ninja mask which he wanted to wear to dinner the other night so I just said fine and now it's in my purse of course because that's what happens it ends up in my purse another another mineral sunblock powder for the same reasons I mentioned before it just ended up in this purse again because I'm back and forth um, this is different I got this at Costco actually such a good score brush on block a package of two for like I don't know $29.99 whereas my one color science was like 50 something dollars so this was a much better value two for 30 bucks it's lower SPF it's SPF 30 but that just means, I don't know, you have to apply it a little more often. Uh, just such a good score, mineral sunscreen. Socks, but not not regular socks, Legree socks. I'm not sure if Legree is a worldwide thing um, or it's just like franchised here in Toronto, but I know there's a YouTube channel called, like for Legree, because I looked it up. Um, but it has, doesn't have really have like a big following or anything, but Legree is kind of a thing here. And what it is, is it's Pilates on a reformer machine. So aside from the gloves that I showed you, these, these gloves that I use for circuit training, I use these socks for Pilates on a reformer, which I do a few times a week and you have to have socks with you. You are not allowed to do the class without them. So every day I put a fresh pair of socks in my bag every day. I mean, every day that I'm doing the class because as soon as I come home from the class, I take my socks out, I put a fresh pair in so that I always have them and I never forget them because if you forget them, they make you buy a pair every time. They're not cheap, but they just have like a rubber grip on the bottom and they have like the toes cut out so your toes are free um, and there's a grip. And um, I just, I love this type of workout. These are just something that are always in my purse, every purse, so there you go. Oh, this Revlon lip gloss, which I would never recommend. It has zero pigment in it. 
I put it on and it's just like clear lip gloss. It looks like it'd be pink and shimmery and cute. No, it has no color to it. I don't recommend this Revlon lip gloss. I don't know what to do with it. I don't, it's a waste of money. Oh, my receipt. Oh, this is such a good reminder. I have two pairs of sunglasses that I just bought. Um, they're sick. They are so cool. They're Versace. Both pairs are Versace. When I get them, I'll show them to you. They are really, really, really cool. Very trendy. One, they're very Versace, which I like in small doses. I can't do the head to toe Versace thing. I appreciate it so much on other people, but on me, I just like, I love Versace right now, but just like accents of it, you know, so these glasses are just perfect. I can't wait to show you them. And they came in and they called me and I forgot and I have the receipt. So that's a great reminder. Oh, I'm just gonna put it here because this is just getting down to the bottom. Um, Baskin Robbins ice cream card. Soft chews, calcium, because I always try and keep some sort of like vitamin or calcium supplement thing in here. So um, this is calcium and vitamin D together, and I just I like to throw it in my purse and just when I remember I take it. It's just good to have. Um, oh, just a, a prescription for my uh, my thyroid condition. I told you guys before I'm hypothyroid, so I have to take medication every day for my thyroid to regulate it. It's something that happened to me during pregnancy. It's not that uncommon to happen to girls during pregnancy. It's just something that I have now that, um, you know, worse things in life, right? But uh, I have to take pills every day for it. So there's my prescription. Speaking of Versace, this is a Versace business card. Um, car keys, hair elastic, lifesavers, the best kind. And last but not least, a poker chip for $5 <laughs> that I was in Vegas over the summer. I don't know. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you would have seen how legendary this Vegas trip was because it was absolutely so amazing. And I shared a lot of it with you guys. Anyways, I did not redeem this Vegas chip, poker chip. I don't know. I, it wasn't mine. My husband just one day just said, put this in your purse because he, I guess he didn't have anywhere to put it. And then we forgot, like, it's just, we didn't do anything with it. I totally forgot. But I just keep transferring it from purse to purse because I love to see it. It's a reminder of that epic trip. And I just, I, I'm just going to keep transferring it until I make my way back to Vegas. That's what I'm going to do. Look out for this chip, you guys. It's going to be with me. It's going to be with me and all my what's in my bags until I get to Vegas. It's $5. Maybe I'll never redeem it because I love it. I actually love this chip. Um, so that's it. It's going back in. And that is everything in my 35 centimeter Tosca Togo Birkin with gold hardware. There you have it. So that's it, you guys. That's all I have for you today. My Birkin, what's in my bag. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I love doing what's in my bag videos because I just, I really do keep it real. That's everything that's in my bag. Most of it's going right back in right now. I got to get to my school pickup. Hey Google, what time is it? It's 2.53. I got to go. I love you guys. Thank you so much for being here. I'll be back in a couple days with another really great video. I cannot wait to see you. Until next time, bye for now.